Hey folks, howdy. Sean Brock here with you with uh, yet another demo, and this is of an instrument that is for sale. If you wouldn't mind, please subscribe. I'd sure appreciate it, and you won't miss a lot of the stuff that we demo. Uh, things that are for sale and a lot of things that aren't that uh, come out of collections. But anyway, this one is for sale. Lucky you. Uh, you can get this real good and early get real good and acquainted with it uh, before Christmas and it is a dandy this is a bourgeois uh, signature uh, it's a DB signature Dana bourgeois signature and I'm gonna go ahead and run the specs of this real quick also if you if you're interested in this guitar see the description box you can email me Sean at seanbrock.com if you forget that you can just google Sean Brock music or musician or something and uh, my website will come up <clears throat> but uh, email is sean at seanbrock.com I will put this on reverb for those who might be looking for financing options uh, but basically this is a 2009 that is extremely clean the only thing I have found on this are very very slight uh, hardly even noticeable uh, marks on the uh, the ears of the headstock just right above the nut, probably from capo storage. <clears throat> but I would call this excellent condition any day. Frets are great. Don't even show anywhere. It's just like it was bought and kind of put up. Uh, wasn't played that much. This is an Adirondack red spruce top. Uh, scalloped uh, forward shifted X bracing, of course. And um, beautiful set of Madagascar rosewood back and sides. It also has koa binding. I always like that, man. Just a real nice, uh, uh, classy thing, you know. Wood binding. I always love wood binding. And uh, ebony fingerboard, ebony bridge. Uh, the uh, head plate, the overlay is Madagascar. The tuners are Waverly Gold. Can't beat Waverly, and of course, a uh, pretty standard spec for Bourgeois. The uh, strap button has been installed. It's uh, bolt on neck, as they usually do. And as I said, the frets are good. The uh, ebony fingerboard, ebony bridge, uh, modern belly there, uh, drop in saddle, solid pins, slotted bridge. And uh, it's funny, I changed the strings on it. And this has uh, Diodario XS Phosphor Bronze, medium, 1356. And uh, the, the pins were just, as, they're the original, and they're just as tight as a brand new guitar. So uh, this guitar has not been uh, tinkered with any. Uh, nice rounded fretboard edge, too, on this. One and 23 30 seconds uh, at the nut. And this is two and 5 16 at the bridge. And as I said, it's a 2009. Let's take a listen to her. And if you want to purchase this, uh, just see the description box. Email me, sean at seanbrock.com. Check it out on Reverb. And uh, this is a very, very reasonable, beyond reasonable uh, price for an instrument of this caliber. Listen to this thing. <laughs> down even over the body and the trebles uh, have a good sweetness a good roundness to them to me but uh, you know the bass very just very round full
check out this bass. This instrument, which is uh, very common, very common for bourgeois, uh, in my experience down through all these years, is they, they really are very, very microphone friendly. They're very, very pickup friendly if you like to install a pickup and play plugged in. Um, because all the frequencies are there, but they have a great, great balance. G chord on. Real nice, real nice. Grab the capo here. Um, you probably assume this, even though I didn't say it. It's a bone nut and saddle, and don't be confused either. Uh, there, there is a bourgeois uh, touchstone that uh, Dana. Uh, voices the tops and then sends them on to uh, Eastman and they have a thing going together and there's a, a touchstone signature on that the uh, Madagascar and don't don't confuse that uh, not that there's anything wrong with that but uh, these are uh, this here is completely assembled in Lewiston Maine there in their regular shop and of course 2009 this uh, precedes any dealings uh, with uh, Andreas Eastman and those folks. Key of A. follows you right along. Move on up to, we'll get the page capo on up to B flat here and travel down through the frets and see what you think. But uh, this is, 
These are these are you know uh, Brian Sutton. Of course, has a long history with Bourgeois, uh, uh, Luke Lovejoy, several people. I saw not long ago. I was looking at a thing where uh, Dana Bourgeois, Bourgeois had cut some tr or uh, taken some trees cut off of uh, Luke Bryant's property and made him a, a, a walnut, a real nice walnut guitar out of it and of course uh, Ricky Skaggs you know Dana has done a lot of stuff with him and these are people who who really care about how something performs uh, in in a microphone situation or in a plugged-in situation and these these excel at that B flat <laughs> so fun to play too they they uh you know this this neck shape and nut width if, if those who follow the channel regularly know that i like a lot of the freely large vintage necks but i enjoy these very very much i i don't know they're just very playable to me and and they always do just such a bang-up job uh of setup i i think bourgeois does uh, out of the gate, probably, I'm going to say the, the better setup of, of a lot of the larger shops. Kid B. fifth for you uh, just so you can hear in the normal range of motion here <laughs> Thank you. 
sweet, man. This thing responds to without you don't have to really dig into it. It it, it just warms up. When it sees a microphone, it's it's like an old friend to it, you know, and, and just very nice to play over a mic. Uh, check out some tone color. Real nice. Okay, well, and we went over the specs. Like I say, this is a, a Madagascar back and sides, a real nice set. Uh, this is a uh, Adirondack red spruce top, uh, scalloped uh, forward shifted scalloped X, ebony bridge, ebony board, bone nut, bone saddle, everything's original, Waverly tuners. Uh, frets are excellent on this. Uh, there is just, I mean, man, I don't. Need, I hate to even say that there's a shadow on the B string on the first uh, two frets, three frets. It's barely even a shadow. I I would hate to know how long you would, how how much life these frets have left in them. They're 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 just. I've I've seen more wear on uh, new guitars in uh, in uh, guitar stores. So. Um, a 123 30 seconds, 2 and 5 sixteenths. Mahogany neck, real pretty volute. I always like their volutes too. Kind of nice little petite thing there. Gold Waverly's, I mentioned that. And this is the Dana Bourgeois Signature. 2009 is when this baby was created. And man, oh man, it's just, uh, my wife saw it and she said, oh, that's a brand new guitar, isn't it? It looks that good. It looks that good. Uh, comes with a nice hard shell case. And if you want it, see the description box. Get in contact with me, Sean at SeanBrock.com. Or if you uh, want it on Reverb, I'll put the uh, link there in the description box for those that might be wanting finance and anything like that. But thank you all. Please subscribe if you haven't done so. And take care.